All right, so there won't be any jokes in this video or anything like that. And it's probably going to be the most serious video I've probably ever laid down personally for myself. And uh, this is all going to be try to be one take because I just don't want to listen to the recording of this one because it's just that heavy of a subject for me personally. And uh, there probably ain't going to be any sprites or editing in this video just because I don't really feel like doing it for this one. And, you know, I don't know if I'm going to add any music in. Maybe we'll see. I, I guess, I don't know, we'll see. But, uh, yeah, I don't know what the title of this is going to be, but just to get off the bat, just straight up, I don't know how long Jason 5 4 can actually exist. I don't know how long we are actually going to be a thing because there's just a lot of IRL things that just pop off at the moment, and I just don't know how much longer I can keep making videos and continue doing the thing I like to do, but because of so much absolute crap that's just happening and it just feels like the universe is against me and I just kind of want to share all of that with you full to the fullest honesty not trying to play any tricks with you guys because the last thing I want to do is try to make some divide between us and there might be a divide between us anyway due to this video but I'll try to be completely honest as I can and I'll do what I and tell you all the information that is I think it's necessary to tell but essentially um I, I guess I had to start back from the beginning so in the beginning why when I first started doing this channel I mainly did it just because I wanted to try to figure out a way to help out my fam and try to help out them with a lot of the debts they are in especially this mortgage that we're dealing with since one of my parents decided it was a great idea which left my mom to be cute trying to pay it off and many sort of ways and nothing has really worked she's tried writing a book that's act that's actually out there and no one has bought anything from that and now she's trying to do a beauty care line of hair of like facial products and stuff like that and no one's really been buying from that because it's expensive i mean it's homemade stuff of course it's gonna be expensive but you know it's not easy and um really she's been trying to do everything that she can and you know a hundred k dollars for a mortgage is a lot of money to pay and it's nothing you could just easily come up with and that's why i decided to try to do youtube back in 2019 when we first started just because i was like you know what maybe i could try to help relieve some of this debt and stuff maybe i could probably do something there's there gotta be a way i can probably do something right that maybe a little bit faster than college you know and no no it, it hasn't been working that well i mean don't get me wrong i am grateful for the 500 people plus that we have on this channel but it's not coming fast enough and honestly there is also another issue that we have to deal with as well and uh for those that well i already told you guys i'm in college well community college to be exact and well, the community college I'm in don't really like their students that much because they like to put them through the ringer when it comes to expensive, but when it comes to expenses, but, and yeah, I got like financial aid and all that, but still a lot of that money goes to those classes and books that, you know, I shouldn't really have to be paying for, yet I'm still pretty much paying for. And this year was probably even worse because this is like the last semester I need to graduate from this community college so I can try to go to another college but uh, that might be not in the case because right now I am not doing so hot in a lot of my classes and it's not great especially in math because like I thought math when I signed up for it it was supposed to be a on-campus learning thing I'm like oh okay I can learn on campus that's fine that's what I wanted for math However, they just up and changed it to be like online only and then there's a lot of bull that ensued which mean I had to get some type of code just to do my assignments which that was already expensive. Then that was, then I had to go find a way to do some kind of lockdown respondus browser type thing so they know that I'm not cheating when I'm doing this type of test, when I'm doing a major testing which is stupid and that has to come by a credit card. Something that I don't have, but my mom does. And I know my mom uses those credit cards for a lot of bills and 
I don't want to stress her out by, you know, adding my trouble to what we are already going through, which is pretty much the big reason why I'm failing a lot of this. And, you know, it just, there's just a lot going on and I don't understand. Like, the school, again, I get why college students, there's a lot of them being homeless because they keep trying to put all these expenses down on you with stuff that you know you can't afford to go get, you know? It's really ridiculous and I don't understand why they keep doing this type of nonsense really. It's just it's just it's just really toxic. It just really messed up. To be perfectly honest with y'all, that and then also they decided to be like, you know what? We're gonna move the finals from the eighth to the second of August. So any hope or chance I had to try to at least you know, um, win at college, pretty much went down the drain. So I am at a loss and I don't know what to do. I'm probably going to fail and I'm not going to be able to graduate, which really sucks because this is, again, the last semester I needed and, you know, there's nothing I can do about it right now. So I just don't know what to do. At this point, I'm kind of at wit's end and I don't know what to do. And I'm starting to hate myself because I don't, because I always make these stupid ass mistakes like i thought maybe if i pursue youtube maybe if i do this hard enough and go in on a lot of topics which i thought could be like you know something to grab people's attention maybe i could do something about this money situation but turns out no i can't do anything as per usual as the universe hates me as it always do and you know not to say that i hate what I'm doing here. I absolutely love what I'm doing when it comes to YouTube. I love talking about these type of topics and all this type of stuff, you know? And, you know, it's it's fun. And to be perfectly honest, again, I still do want to help a lot of people out, a lot of communities out when it comes to, you know, harassment and all that type of stuff. But how can I help anybody else when I can't even help myself when I need it the most, to be honest? I mean, not trying to put anybody else's, like, you know, problems down or anything but I can't do much if you know if I'm not going to be here for a while in the future and I was hoping to make a miracle happen before I graduated but looks like that's going to be a problem in the making so I really don't know what to do I'm trying my best not to like get emotional while recording this right now because it, it really hurts but um I'm trying to figure out everything I can possibly do, make connections with a lot of people as I possibly can, and it's just not going the way I thought it would. That I thought it would. So that's also another issue. And don't think I'm for saying like, oh, you just did all this topics just because you wanted money, so you don't really care about the lolly community and stuff. Like I absolutely do. Like I wouldn't have gone that far to collab with Alice if that wasn't the case. Like I could care le like if it, if I was only doing this for money and solely for money. I could literally care less about what Alice does, like that if that would have been the case. But I do care about Alice and I do care about the community as a whole. So and plus making tons of videos to be honest like that, ruining probably the a good part of my reputation as an anime YouTuber in a lot of people other people's eyes, it's probably my reputation and stuff of what I can do is probably already tarnished. So you know, this so I can't fate that, to be perfectly honest. Well, I wouldn't go that far if that was the case, if I was just solely doing it for money. But of course not. But no, I haven't. Actually, there has been like one person that has don donated before. I think it was like Black April Samurai. And he gave away like $5, which I still had that 5 to this day. And that was really thoughtful and thankful for that. But... There's just a lot of things that's going on. There's just a lot of money related issues that keep going on and there's nothing really I can think of to do. And it really sucks when I keep seeing people like, oh, like a ton of YouTubers be like, oh, I'm giving away a thousand dollars to my friends for getting this thing right or for this quiz or whatever. Or like, I'm just going to fake donate money to a lot of people, which really sucks because there's people like me who could really use that cash and really could be able to help myself out because if the whole thing was if I could get money off of this, I'll pay off the mortgages on I'll pay off the mortgages off this house, then I would pay off 
all the other credit card bills that my mom has, and then I would try to find myself a place to stay for myself. But that's not really in the cards at all, because, well, it just isn't. I don't really like making these sob story videos because it's just not a good thing, honestly. I mean, to be perfectly honest, I shouldn't be trying to put my problems onto you and all that, but this has been eating at me for like a, a long time now, and there's nothing really feel like holding me back from saying all this, so that's why I'm pretty much doing it now. I really regret buying that Nintendo Switch now at early the year. Really should have hold off on that if I knew all this was going to happen, but um, it, I, there's nothing I can do about it now. But yeah, there's just a lot of there's just a lot of issues going on. Not to mention, uh, for people that aren't sort of new, uh, I've been having migraines and they still haven't really stopped, and it's been a pain. I've been dealing with them for a, a hot minute now, which also contributes to not being able to do schoolwork because I'm in so much flipping pain to the point it's ridiculous. So it's just not been easy. It's just not been. And again, in the future, in the near future, if things don't turn around by the end of this class semester, I don't know how much longer Jason Vice 4 can actually be a thing. And it sucks because we're really just that close to 600 now. And you know, the goal was to get to at least 100k, then I could quit, and then we'll see what happens, but, you know, it just doesn't, it's not working out the way I would think it would. And, again, another stupid thing I thought I could do, be a YouTuber or be an artist, because I tried being an artist at one point and, you know, commission stuff, but no one wanted to buy anything, so that's another thing that kind of screwed me over, so, you know, I thought I could do stuff myself, but then... Because nothing in my life wanted to move, so I decided to try to move it myself, but apparently just making things worse, as it always do. And which leads me to think bad thoughts about myself, which personally I'm too scared to do, but you know, do, to, do things to myself, but you know, it, it is what it is. Anyway, um, I don't want to keep this going too much longer, to be perfectly honest, because again, I don't want my promise to be something that you constantly think about, but... And I don't honestly know what's going to happen in the future, but I'm trying everything I know how to do when it comes to YouTube, when it comes to being an artist and everything to try to get. And when it comes to money, I'm trying everything at my absolute best, but I cannot figure out a single shred of things to 100% do. It's just, it's tough. It's tough. And I know some of you might be like, well, why don't you tell us about your mom's, like, store and stuff? Maybe we can buy from there and help you out. Well, there is one major thing I haven't told you, and it's due to my religion and stuff. So, as you know, really, I shouldn't be, you know, be on YouTube like this, talking about this type of stuff. And it doubles so for the fact my mom's a minister, which is something I never really told y'all. And a prophetess. So, yeah, I'll, someone that's, so the son of a... So, really, a minister's son who is talking about lollicon stuff really shouldn't be talking about this type of stuff. But the only reason why I decided to go this far with it, one reason besides trying to help you guys out and try to understand this side of the community, is because I thought maybe I could just get some more views if we do something out of pocket like this, or maybe get some more stuff so I can actually help. But that has not been the case. And I don't regret my decision about doing the whole lolly thing, it just, it's a lot. It, it just, I thought it could help me a little bit more, but turns out no. But yeah, so that's probably a bigger, another reason why, you know, things aren't going to go, e wouldn't go easy if I were to just link you all the stuff where she has done, but it, it just, it's just a difficult road. Anyway, I don't want to keep this list going on too much further. There's nothing really more I could say, except maybe that. I don't know, maybe at some point the Danganronpa sprites have to go away at some point. Mainly because I don't want Spike Chunsaw to be coming out of nowhere and be like, Hey, hey, you're using our stuff. Now you're making money off it. We're going to sue you. That's why I'm so trying to look for, find people that could actually draw my uh, channel, my character's channel, my channel's character. And um, try to, you know, make sprites of him so I can use him instead of using the actual sprites of the game. But, you know... 
it's hard to find people that can do that and do it right and it's also again coming down to expensive with to expenses so you know a lot of things is just going wrong so when it comes down to all this i don't have much of anything i'm not really much of a person at all to be perfectly honest i don't really think of myself higher than anything at all i'm just a regular average person there's nothing special i can do not much more much less as make a video and just hope it helps someone out at some point in time you know that's pretty much all i'm doing at this point and there's nothing really much i can really think of myself to be nice about i don't like myself that much and it kind of shows especially in this video i don't really like a lot of things about myself and there's just a ton of hatred i have so for my own being so you know not really mentally in a great place but i was hoping maybe things could change up when we do youtube but apparently life don't really like me that much and i understand why so yeah um pretty much of all things that come down to your sim simpai just need some money and i hate being a beggar person or begging like this because you know it makes me look weak or pathetic but what else am I supposed to do? I can't really do anything. I'm going to fail college in a couple of days. And then I'm going to, you know, not be able to help out my mom and her bills. And hopefully I was hopefully thinking we could take out this mortgage. But, you know, that's not going to be out. That's not going to be an option, you know. And really, I also want to just try to see if I can make my mom smile one more time at least. I mean, the, my mom is about to be 60. Like... She shouldn't be trying to figure out things about how to make money and stuff. Like, it just hasn't been an easy life. It just hasn't. And I was hoping maybe I could do something to perhaps change the tide. But it looks like that won't be happening. So, I don't know how much longer this channel is going to last. I don't know how much longer um, these videos could stay up. Of course, I'll still be adding videos as I still go, as I have some time. But don't know how much more work I can put into this channel because of the current situation. Like I said, I didn't want to be holding back any information with you guys. I didn't want to be, you know, like lying or anything like that. But I'm just trying to tell you the straight up truth. There may not be a future for me anymore if things don't go and change the way I need it to. Because... It's just not easy. Life has been literally been kicking me in the teeth for years now. And it's not been great. It has not been an amazing journey, honestly. It has been a struggle. And I know people like the underdog story and things be like, oh, finally, the underdog story. Maybe he can get some potential to do something because that's when, you know, when you're at your lowest, the things start happening. This is, as sad as I hate to say, this ain't fiction, bro. This ain't fiction. An underdog story could either go two ways and right now it is going the way of just more suffering and there is no redemption arc for me and as much as i want to help people and do other things and try to save a lot of kids out there as we've been talking recently about that may not even be happening there may be just a lot more people to suffer because i can't be able to do something maybe the universe is against me because i want to do something good and then it knows it or something like that. I don't know. But point is. There is nothing really much I can do. I'm really at wit's end when it comes to. Figuring out money. And stuff like that. Something I'm not good at with. Something I'm not good with. Honestly. Is being smart. And I don't really. And I'm using every tactic in the book. And I don't know what else I can do. There is literally nothing else I can do to. Figure out to grow this channel a lot bigger than I want it to be. There's tons of ideas I want to do with this channel. There's plenty of ideas I want to do, especially if I were to get to be invited to Anime Expo. But that's probably not going to happen either. So, you know, it, it's, I don't know. I really don't know. But that, I'm not going to stretch out this conversation anymore because you're probably already tired of hearing me speak. As I'm tired of hearing myself speak as well. So, you know, it, it is what it is. But... If you have anything that you can donate to the Cash App, it will be a blessing, honestly. It will be something that 
even I would be like, okay, I guess, I don't know, because honestly, I'm starting to feel like my existence doesn't matter, and I'm trying to hold back the tears right now, but it's whatever. But anyway, if you do have anything you can donate, uh, there is Cash App, you know. I, um, I don't really know much about taxes, so I can't do PayPal right now, but even though I do have that set up, but um, there is, but Cash App is available, and if if somehow someone were to come out with a donation of money, a huge amount of money or something like that to PayPal, then I'll try to figure out a way to set it up, and we'll see about that, but um, Cash App is mainly where I'm just going to take, where if you have anything, uh, that's where I'll mainly you um keep the donated money but other than that that's pretty much all that i had to say with this one i didn't want to try to keep you guys in the dark and i made similar videos to this before but i always pretty much kind of joked over it and never really like you know be too serious with it but this is me at my point of being like this ain't jason pi exploring anymore this is just your regular average dude so yeah, that's pretty much it for this one. So hopefully you have a nice day and uh, sign off. Have a blessed day.